Hello everyone and welcome to the life of Michael Jameson. My name is Michael Jameson aka MJ and it is the weekend of my unbirthday. Now what is an unbirthday? This is an idea that Claire and I had when we were in Sweden recently. I believe it sort of does exist already. Um, I think people called it not birthday or something. That's, that's stupid. That's not what this is. This is totally different, right? So, an unbirthday. Basically, I was born in February, which means that I've uh, got a gap of about six weeks between Christmas and my birthday. Uh, that is a very small amount of time. That means I go without presents for like nearly 11 months of the year, which is just awful. Um, no one should be put in that position. So, the unbirthday is as far away from my birthday as you can possibly get, which. Uh, <laughs> Happens to be tomorrow, the 12th of August. Um, so, we're not doing anything too special. I understand Claire's brought me some gifts, slash gift, uh, which is very, very kind and thoughtful of her. Um, it sort of was raised, as sort of a, a half-jokey idea in Sweden, so I was quite surprised when she said that, remember, it's your unbirthday on Sunday, which she said recently, which is really lovely. I'm now very excited. It's going to be super, super cool. Um, but, yeah, it's, you know... It's a great idea, and it's not, it's not not birthday, that is a dickhead idea. Like, this is a, just a private thing between Claire and I, this is not a, uh, we're not throwing a party or anything, I don't expect presents from everyone. I do expect presents from Claire, but I don't expect presents from everyone, and that's what sets me apart from people who do, like, not, not birthday parties and invite everyone, no, that's bad, you shouldn't do. It's a private thing between two consenting adults, okay? Anyway, we are going to go to the supermarket now, um, and that'll be cool. I'll point out a few products if I see them. Uh, and also, I've been drawing some Pokemon this morning for a video that's probably already, uh, not probably, that has definitely already gone up on this channel. I've been drawing some Pokemon, uh, like a lowland forms of Pokemon. Uh, inked those ones. That's why they look a bit better than the others. Uh, and probably they just are better, actually. Um, but yeah, cheers. Wasn't too much interest in an Audi, I just took a photo of some foot long hot dogs for Instagram, so have a gander on that. We're just at the cinema Audion to watch The Meg, a film about a large shark in uh, what critics are calling a groundbreaking cinematic experience. Prawn, prawn star posting, I nice. Good pun. I think it's been a while since I filmed actually. We've uh, we've been home several hours. We saw the Meg, guys. I uh, really enjoyed it actually. I thought it was decent. I thought there were some quite imaginative action scenes and there were some sort of decent sharky moments which you'd sort of expect. Jason Statham's good. The characters are, yeah, good. Fairly good. Um, it's bombastic, isn't it? Yeah, probably slightly better than I expected really. I, I mean, it is very cheesy. Um, the storyline is very sort of, oh, that's ridiculous and bullshit but I, I have to say it did get better on it as it got on uh, there was some sort of like oh this is so stupid this is fucking ridiculous in the setup but no it's, it's good and it's you, you absolutely expect it with the territory this is a film about a giant shark so uh, no I definitely enjoyed it I'd, I would uh, I would recommend it actually uh, I have now finished um, my Pokemon drawings and by that I mean I've finished inking them as well I will put some images on screen uh, maybe of the coloured versions as well um, so here's my Squirtle sort of ones going into Blastoise, and my probably my favourite ones, the first ones I did actually, uh, Charmander into Charizard. Um, yeah, so cool. I think I'm just going to do a tiny bit of tidying up on the computer, and in the actual real world, just go and put that in the bin and whatnot. And um, I think we're going to get some dinner. Actually, I could show you some food type stuff if you would enjoy that. Uh, a lot of you might be fans of Food Review UK, so you probably will. Angel Delight White Chocolate. That is out because I'm making it tomorrow. Finally, bloody found Fox's Glacier Spearmints. Um, saw them advertised absolutely yonks ago. There's nothing interesting in there, apart from there's still Easter stuff in there. Um, there's my stupid face. Uh, there is something interesting in here. This product here. This is marinating chicken thighs. Uh, we're gonna have chicken souvlaki tomorrow. This uh, this fridge smells very herby. There is a herb finishing sauce. This recipe was from Heston Blumenthal on the uh, Munchies YouTube channel. So to be honest, I'm sort of expecting good things. Don't think I've ever tried one of his recipes before. 
but uh, I assume it will be Michelin star standard. Also, guys, I'm an absolute pervert. I'm getting into juice with juicy bits. I got juice with bits in. I'm a fucking pervert. Seriously, there's something wrong with me. I willingly got orange juice with bits in. I feel sick. We decided to get Indian in the end. Um, I forgot to film it, so never really filmed the takeaway that we get. There's some poppadom. There, all right. Just watching a theme park worldwide and playing, oh, I don't want to concede, Jesus, playing Hearthstone. Uh, cheers. Good morning. <sighs> 8 a.m. And I am going to do some digital colouring now. I uh, thought I might film a little bit of the process. Minifigures! We got minifigures. We got Dean Thomas, Luna Lovegood, Dobby, Harry Potter, and the chick from Fantastic Beasts. I can't remember her name. There's the film there. Cool! Oh, I finally finished. I finally finished, right? So, yep, I finally finished the artwork. Um, it took a very long time. But I'm relatively happy with the results. Um, I'm going to make my. I'm just going to edit the video together now. And uh, yeah, cool. So yeah, some better than others, I guess. But whatever. So, day is going well. Dinner has been being made. Has been being grilled. Chicken, grilled chicken. The flatbreads are over there. There we go. Ow, oh, bugger. That was hot. Nah. Wow, look at all that. The rich roasting juices jumping up. It's nearly ready, actually. Getting some nice charring on the outside. I think it's nearly ready anyway. It's hard to tell because on the YouTube video that I watched, it was done over a spit roast for uh, constantly rotating for three hours. So this is in a grill. I do it for one hour, um, which I'm hoping is going to be okay. Got some backup tortillas. Uh, this is roasted garlic mayo and a herby sort of dressing. I think I mentioned yesterday this is the Heston Blumenthal recipe. Probably get that out now. The uh, I use the term pickled cabbage loosely. It's pickled in as, in as much as it's lemon juiced because I don't like vinegar. 
Uh, Richard's here. Yay! Hello! Hello! Welcome. What have you been up to? What's this? What's going before me in this vlog? Uh, this is my unbirthday weekend vlog. Ooh. Did you know it's my unbirthday? Happy unbirthday. Oh, thanks, man. Cheers. Yeah. Thank you. How old are you? How old are you? Uh, 31 and a half wow. inches. <laughs> Hi, Claire. Hi, How's it going? Thanks. Do you want to try yogurt? Yogurt Fanta? Oh, do I? Smell it. You like from? You literally bought from our fray this week. <laughs> oh God. Correct. It's not bad. It's fine. It's nice. Yeah, it's alright. Yeah, it's alright. Weird. Yeah, weird. Mm. It's fine. It smells better than it tastes. Correct. So yeah. Do you want to try clear coke? Yeah. Clear coke as well. If you want to see the reviews for these, check out Food Review UK. It says it's got some lemon in it as well, which I didn't realise, or we didn't realise either. Correct. I actually prefer that to um, the Fanta. When I say that that's that's a that is like quite thick, but not thick, but like syrupy in a way. Yeah, correct. Syrupy sweet. Do you know what I mean when I say that? This is a bit sweeter than normal cake. Mm. Yeah, probably. And there's no calories in it. It's like a diet. Oh. One. Weird. Very there's weird. Leftover dinner. Quite there's actually slightly less uh <laughs> slightly less leftover than I uh thought Hannah's cookies. Well you did give me a few Made it onto the vlog. Yeah, that is true. Did give you two. Two very small ones, but um yeah. It was very successful guys. Um so right that's that section and then here's the thing things. Rich is trying oh, the, cake. Yeah, his birthday cake, yeah. Rich is trying the red vines. Birthday cake twisted. They're bad, aren't they? What, what colour is that? Oh, like mixed. Is that that one? Oh no, red. I think they're all. Oh, they're all the same flavour here. Oh, right. Just bad, though, isn't it? Why have I just had another one? What? Why have I just had another one? Yeah. <laughs> Which is just about to leave. Just going for a wee wee. I was showing off my artwork because I'm an absolute lad. Uh, we filmed a few videos, a few food reviews, and whatnot. All of my eBay stuff has sold, some for not quite as much as hoped or expected, but hey, definitely not complaining. And yeah, just need to get them posted, I guess. So I'll get that sorted, reply to a few comments. Uh, yeah, cool. Unusual camera angles are enjoyable for the viewers. Yeah, this is for the life of you. Yeah. Wow. So, yeah. Well, goodbye everyone and goodbye, MJ. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Goodbye.